what about then the emotionality of a movement or the spirituality of a movement or the passion of a movement? I can look at two dancers, one will be very mechanical and they go, wow, great technique. I will look at the other dancer doing the same moves and my breath leaves my body. Yeah. What's the difference? What's going on? Of uh, different performers? Yeah. <laughs> um, okay, so here's my naughty question. Could I say to you, Michael, could you get up and act both those dancers? Do the dancer with the charisma and the gift, and can you turn that off and do the mechanical movements? Would that be possible? I'll say this. The difference between the two can't be taught. You, you, you do or you don't. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm much more uh, come, I've you know, been away from teaching for a while and I'm coming back to teaching. It's like, I cannot teach you to be one or the other. You are one or the other. You are either a storyteller or you're not. Either you um, have that switch when all of a sudden it's all present, rough, untrained as it might be, or you don't. That's what they, they say about acting too. You can't teach acting. No. You can teach everything around it. Yeah. But you have the switch to step into another person or you don't. Or you don't. And I sort of want to believe that, you know, in, in sort of principle, but to hear you say it also in that in respect to movement and dance, you go, yeah. So what do you do with a student who turns up in your studio who Maybe, maybe they don't know where the switch is. Can you help them to that switch? Maybe. You can give them a lot of love, though, because a lot of people come through acting or training programs uh, n not to finish where you think everybody believes they're supposed to finish. Like, I'm an actor. It's, it's not a good reason to have an acting program. The student in any program is on some kind of a journey and you're a caretaker your job is to care take that person during that time to help them grow in some way um, whether your litmus test is oh they're they're very professional you know or they're they're ready they're right there. They're ready to just enter into the workforce. Um, to me, seems like a really awful um, measuring stick for what everyone's doing in this program. It's much, much better to go, uh, this person's here, and I'm here, and we're in the same space together, and we're, we're working on this thing together, and I hope I don't get in their way um, as they f figure their business out. Whether it's going to be an actor or a dancer or an architect or whatever, it's like I'm, I'm here to offer some information uh, to you. I don't know if you're here to be an actor. I don't know if you're here to be a dancer. I mean, you're telling me that you are. But this is just a liminal place for you to just become a, a, a changed human being